All right, guys, welcome back to another video. We are going to be destroying some trucks. We're going to be doing some pretty crazy off-road towing on a really, really cool logging map that I've never been on. So I got the 6.7 liter Powerstroke F250 Platinum Edition, and then I got huge tires on here. They are uh, they're mud terrain because we're going to go through a lot of mud today. And I got a 20-foot dual axle uh, logging trailer here. So it's it's a gooseneck hitch. It's, it's, I think it looks really cool. And uh, it's quite a bit of weight. So we loaded it down with some logs, got some weight on there. And it's uh, it, it's one of the nurse. It has like a nurse package on here. So we can hold some fuel and stuff. I thought that was pretty cool. And uh, and yeah, I think our setup looks really good. Got Ruby Red. She looks clean. Of course, got the platinum interior dual, dual sunroof or moonroof, whatever you like to call them. And then Ian's going to be running the GMC. Make sure to go check out his channel. Link is in the description. It's the AT4 HD package. Of course, 4x4. He's got some BFGs all terrain. They look really good. We'll see how those do in the mud. They should do like all right. But um, he's got a little less weight. But of course, they got the Duramax. We're doing all diesel truck. And then heading over, Wade has the 2500 Cummins Ram. Looks really clean, lifted. Some pretty big mud tires on there as well. So pretty much what we're doing is we're, we're testing out everything. Also, we have a Chevy somewhere. That I'll show you. All right, here comes the big cat, the big bad bolt. He's pulling in. How's it going, bolt? Good. Dang good American. You got the 2500 Duramax Chevy. We'll see see how it does. Is this lifted a bit? A little bit. A little but bit. Not that much. Okay. You got big old mud trains on there. We'll see. We'll see how it does. I think bolt stacked the most. I think you have the most weight just by a bit. But are you ready to go, man? Yeah, I am ready. Whenever. Whenever they're getting ready. Done. I don't know what they're yeah. doing, playing with some hay bales or something. Ian, how's it going? Hey, how's it going? Pretty good, pretty good. Do you think this Duramax can make it up the hill? Oh yeah, the 2020 GMC will sure make it. We'll see, we'll see. I think the power strokes gonna do the best, but you got some all terrains, man. I think you'll you'll need some mud terrain. Yeah, it should be pretty good. Uh, it's it's a new truck, so we'll see. Yeah, we will. But uh, I think we're gonna have. Let's have. Who knows the trails the best? Uh, I think Bolt mapped it out. Bolt mapped a it little, out? Yeah, I know him a little bit. All right, well, I have no idea where we're going. What is this map called again? All right, the map is called Homakra, I believe is how you pronounce it. Anyway, it's a uh, it's a giant editor a map. It's in it's in the in-game mod hub, so a lot of you guys can go and download it. Super uh, super nice map so far. Really fun trails. I'll, let's get going here. Enough talking. Let's hit the trails. All right, guys, you hear me on the radio? Loud and clear. All right, Bolt, you want to lead the way, big cat? All right, Bolt, go ahead and whip it around, man. Get, jump up front yeah. see a big bad bull don't come back on me if i'm behind you on a hill all right i will try not to <laughs> i'll try not to all right ian you good back there yeah i'm the caboose all right and then we got wade yeah ian's the caboose i forgot i forgot and then wade's directly behind me so nice and easy guys gonna get muddy at first and then i think we're gonna hit concrete in the end but it's gonna be uh or not concrete gravel how fast you want to take this nice and slow man nice and slow you, you go i mean go as fast as you can up the hill you're gonna need every inch of it yeah, I'm worried about. I'm oh my goodness, on. guys. Check this out. It is so bumpy. There we go. Come on, Bolt. All right, Bolt's doing good. I got to keep up the pace. All right, keep going here. Keep climbing. So these these are pretty crazy trails. Super bumpy, super muddy. Uh-oh. Okay, Bolt's slowing down. I need to keep my momentum up. Do not want to stop when I'm just about to the crest of the hill. I can barely see over my hood. We're going up. So there we go. Now we can actually see the road. Now, the logs are a little sketchy in the trailer. Just how the game works. You can tell they're like a little weird like that, but... We do our best. There's a huge boulder in the middle of the thing there. There we go. Up and over. All right. This is pretty sick. Yeah. Like I said, I can't do much about the logs. Wish we could fix them there. Oh, my God. GMC looks so cool back there. Come on. Oh, that's so sick. Diesel power. Okay. It looks like we got some water coming up. Nice and easy. Some of these trees are like scratching the side of the truck too. All right. This is, uh, let's, let's just crawl here. Check this out. That is so cool. Oh, man. There we go. I mean, a lot of people say, like, diesels aren't good in the mud, which they aren't. It's just extra weight, especially on the front end of the truck, just to bog you down even more. But the good thing about it is that we're towing. So I got mud drain tires on there to help out. But it's, uh, of course, 4x4, four four, all that good stuff. All right, I'm going to try and catch Bolt here. It's going to get pretty dicey before it gets good. Like I said, we're going to hit some gravel. But oh, my goodness. Uh-oh, we're missing. Some tires aren't touching the ground. Come on. All right, stay on the road. Gosh, dang it. No, watch out. Okay, that looks like some mud right there. All right, where did Bolt go? All right, he took a left. All right, nice and easy. Ian's catching me. I need to catch up with Bolt here. I don't want to go too fast, though. All right, nice up and over. This isn't too bad. I do feel like the weight when I go... Especially when I go downhill, it feels like I get pushed pretty hard. But there we go. And then I feel like if this... If we had this weight on the bumper... Every time we went up like a, speak, a steep hill or like we crest over hill, I would just be popping a wheelie the whole entire time. That would be just so much weight on the bumper. There we go. And now you can kind of feel like 
the weight is still on the rear end of the truck, but it's just obviously not as bad with the gooseneck hitch. All right, is it Bolt? You doing good up there, man? I caught up with you. Yeah, I saw it down, but I didn't see you anymore. Yeah, yeah, go slow. I think it's better. I almost, I went off the path back there, and he almost hit, ran into the back of me. So I tried to speed it up a bit. I'm going 12 right now. Okay. So. Yeah. I mean, we're moving along pretty quick, but it's nice and easy. Ian, how are you doing? How's the GMC holding up? Uh, it's holding pretty good. Hopefully the incline doesn't get any uh, more because uh, it's not going to be good. I don't know if we can get any steeper than the beginning. That was that was pretty scary. Not going to lie. I might have wet my pants a bit back there, but don't tell anybody. All right. When is a bad time to tell you? I have no idea where I'm going. Uh, Right now isn't a terrible time. Okay. Okay. Good. So you don't know where Good we're idea. going. Here, let me pull off real quick. I'm going to pull up the map. Okay. All right, I'm let's pulling see. my map right now. If we keep going, let's keep going straight. We're going to hit, uh, yeah, just keep going straight. Stay to the right, and then we'll take our first left on gravel. So we want to stay on the yeah. gravel roll? Or we're going to we're gonna jump on the gravel. We'll take a left on it. Okay. All right, nice and easy here. Is, is it me or is the trail getting a bit skinnier? Uh, I think it's just you. How many uh, just... how many Coca-Colas do you have this morning? <laughs> and I had three this morning, and... Uh, I, I think it's good, but there is a pretty big cliff on the right. True. Yeah, don't fall off that cliff. I'm surprised Bolt hasn't already, but... Passed up weight. I don't... I think he had some electronic issue, but I think he's behind me now. Okay, good. That works yep. good. All right, nice and easy little descent here. Is that water down there, Bolt? A little muddy? Kind of. Okay. On the side. Don't worry about it that much. Okay. Oh, yeah. It's a bit... Get some speed going through there, Ian. All right. Oh, yeah. It's getting muddy. Yeah, it is. I feel like we're kind of in a low spot where a lot of water. Yep, there's there's puddles and stuff, so just be careful. All right, Bolt, we're coming up to the gravel. Just take a left yep, here. All right, all right, all right. So what what are we doing once we get up to the spot? Just detach from the trailers and. They're at actually they have a loader up there, and we're able to pit it up and. Oh, okay, okay, perfect. I didn't I didn't know that. Which I don't know if I want to drive that or not. So, you can drive it. Uh, yeah, I'll, I'll take the wood off with the loader. That's fine. So, all right, the, this is this is uh, this is a lot smoother than oh, big incline. How does it look, Bolt? It's not too bad. Good. You're on there gravel. There must be a cabin or something up here because these are uh, pretty nice gravel roads. Yeah, there's gotta be, or this is what they always take in and out, and we took the wrong path, and there's yeah. gravel to like a like a blacktop or something. Actually, yeah. I kind of slip up that road. My tires, fun. I did, I did pro just fine, but yeah, that wasn't wasn't too bad. Here we go. What's up ahead, Bolt? A open aquarium, basically. Okay, that's. I'm pretty sure that's where we pull off. All right. You know what, Bolt? We missed our turn. We did. Or er... no, are are we going down far? Yeah, we we missed our turn. We we're supposed to take a right back there. I think if we stay on the gravel road, actually, we can make it this way. Okay. Okay, that works. We turn here. Are you oh, sure? dang it. Yeah. I almost got you there. You you were trying to pass me. I didn't even notice. I'm too busy looking at Google Maps. Yeah, I was gonna go around the roundabout and pass you up, but I'm positive. We take this down. All right, you're positive. Where's our end goal? I'm looking on the map here. I'm just curious. Uh, I think it's a gas station or something. Yeah, you know that gas station down the very corner of the map. Okay, gotcha, gotcha. Very cool. Be careful. I'm kind of, I'm gaining on you here, Bolt. Yeah, I'm going slow. I yeah, could no, speed up. it's good. It's good. We should we should probably go really slow. There we go. It is so fun to turn around and like see Ian and see. See Wade back there. Oh, it's just so sick. The just the headlights and I something about the GMC front end I just love. Yeah, it looks good. It looks really, really good. I think it's gonna make a good plow truck in the winter too. Yeah, that's it's an AT4. You should be able to. Yeah. Be good for plowing. For sure. Chevy will so small compared to all your trucks. Yeah, it. I mean, it's lifted a bit, but yeah, it is just it is a little bit different. I do have a winch though. So he is stuck. You have a winch on your truck? It's on the back oh. and the like bumper. Nice. Well, let us know if anybody gets stuck. It looks like they log logged this part of the field here on the left already. So yep. there we go. We got a big uh, rock in front of us there. Be careful. Nice and slow over that. A little speed bump. All right, guys, if you're enjoying today's episode, make sure to smash the like button. Please subscribe if you haven't already. Super fun taking these trucks off load. Let me, let me know if you want to do. I was thinking about doing some crazy button with it. Now, this towing, it's tough because like... Towing in this game isn't perfect. You can't really feel like every weight. Um, but, I mean, if we max it out, if we put a, a certain amount of weight in it, I'm, I'm pretty sure we can. But this is a good warm-up, a really good test for him. And uh, I love this map. It's kind of... I want to do some logging on this map. Let me know for those who are watching this late into the video because a lot of times those who watch late, like watch all the time, you guys really enjoy the videos. I was thinking on this map, starting a little logging series. I've done it in the past, starting from scratch. And I kind of thought that would be fun to do it again. And I really like logging 
when it comes to like I guess doing it like bare bones kind of not having big scorpion kings not, not like having big operation then making some money I don't know it's kind of fun and uh, let me know what you think of a series like that have some employees and we just have maybe a truck or two in a trailer and uh and try and do ultra realistic let me know what you guys think of that i think it would be a lot of fun all right bolt scooting away from here i gotta go catch up this is getting pretty dense in here again and then i personally i don't really know where we're going but i just gotta trust blindly with bolt and usually he messes oh uh oh what's up bolt? Sorry, i'm checking my gps i didn't know where to go okay are, are we on the right ahead. path straight ahead yep all right, yeah looks good guys straight ahead. looks good it is dense like are you guys just barely getting in between these trees yep. yeah I mean, it's like smacking my toe mirrors every time. Yeah, do I don't that? have my toe mirrors out, so that's... How do, the, how do, like, big logging equipment even get back here? I feel like it must be... Semis and very talented drivers. Well, or yep. just no mirrors and pin or straight, full sin. Yeah, there is other roads we could have took, but... Yeah. <laughs> I took the more fun road. I'm sure at and... times, like, certain roads go down or, like, they're overused and it starts to rain, and so they, they make different roads. That would make sense. Here's a house. Uh, yeah, yeah, they're creating close. We're here. Oh, cool. Very cool. They got a loader down here. Yep. You're supposed to dump, take the loader, hit up our wads, and dump it in the silo. Type thing. Okay. Cool, cool. I hope the loader can fit between these two gates. Yeah, I I wonder we if can we can. We can lower them, too. Do you think I should run this? We'll see. It's up to you. I can try the first one. Go ahead, take the straps off, and I'll run it. All right, let's see if I still got it. I wonder... I wonder if I do. Let's see see what we can get here. He said to just put it into the silo. I wonder what kind of process they have after that, but see what I can. There we go. Got my first log. Very nice. All right, we're getting Bolt's truck unloaded here. Just trying to figure it out a bit. It's kind of tough having ran equipment like this in a in a hot minute, but I got I already went ahead and got Ian's unloaded. His trailer is unloaded and already in here, and then uh, they went ahead and unloaded the bales so here we go push 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 watch out bolt don't want to get you all right there we go that's a huge uh the the wheel loader doesn't really feel the weight too much but it's more what what it can't do is it can't like uh squeeze them too good so i i don't want to bump this guy can i bump him there we go the problem is the claw the claw doesn't grip everything now the new holland w190d has plenty of weight to get the job done like the machine itself but yeah like i said it's just the, the hydraulics of actually getting the logs in here i, I kind of like this but it doesn't work every time there we go got one more to do and then we should be good all right guys hopefully you enjoyed today's episode if you did make sure to smash the like button please subscribe if you haven't already it was kind of fun to see what did the best personally it was, it was kind of tough to tell, but I really liked how the power stroke ran. And it was just cool to see everybody pull some really heavy weights. So Bolt's going to finish up the rest of the load. But like I said, thank you all so much for watching. Peace out, and I'll see you in the next one. Mm -hmm.